Alright, hello. So our daily thoughts today for the 23rd of January. Um, let's see where. I really wanted to talk about some movies because anybody who knows me knows I love movies. Movies and music. Let's talk about some newer ones that I just got a chance to see. Just coming out on DVD was Don't Be Afraid of the Dark, which is a remake of an old TV movie or something. Um, I'm sure it was a cheesy old movie. The new movie, I have to say, is not cheesy. It didn't get the greatest reviews, but I'll tell you. I mean, yes, it has Katie Holmes in it. That's a downside, obviously, because she can't act her way out of a paper bag. But Guy Pierce is good and cute, and the little girl is a really good actress. Um, the whole premise that they, you know, Katie Holmes is the girlfriend of Guy Pierce. The daughter is his daughter, you know mother come has her come live with the father and his girlfriend you know i don't want kitty holmes as my mother blah 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 kind of thing you know there's a little bit of that but what's really cool is it's not really your conventional thriller because it deals with not like a slasher but there's some weird creatures in it and it's kind of eerie and anybody who knows me knows i like a non-conventional ending and it does have a non-conventional kind of um ending that kind of leaves you with a weird feeling in your stomach. Um, another movie that I just saw recently. Um, everyone was telling me to watch this documentary called Food, Inc. Um, supposedly a few years ago it came out and it was all about like an expose on the food we eat and meat and stuff like that. Well, I watched it and the beginning of the movie shows the maker of the movie getting a hamburger and eating it and it looked so good so I was hungry about five minutes later I was not hungry they show you how they mistreat the animals granted they are there to be slaughtered for us to eat but still it is a little disturbing to watch and how they brought out that a lot of the food com like meat companies there used to be tons in the United States and now there's only like seven that produce meat massively and different companies buy it and put their name on it I thought that was pretty cool also, about how they genetically, like, engineer chickens in the last 30 years to grow bigger breasts and fatter. So they grow so big that they end up waddling and falling over. They can't even hold themselves up before they're slaughtered. Kind of morbid. Um, we went to see The Devil Inside. Let me tell you. As far as movies go where they tell you at the beginning, this is a true story. And, um, you know people have like a it's almost like a video camera version of a movie and they want you to think it's real the acting and stuff in this and the storyline this really felt kind of real and i'll tell you i had a sick feeling in the pit of my stomach when it was over and if you've seen it you know what i mean so i want to hear what you guys think about the movies i mentioned and any other new movies that have come out and give me your reviews and see if i should see them you know there's a lot i haven't seen a lot i have seen um, but give me movie titles. Give me feedback. I have tons of fun doing this. And I'm glad y'all liked the videos. So, peace out.